Hey everyone, welcome back to more Fallout 4. So, guess what I found out? So, uh, you see these two, right? This is where the this is where like the story mission branch off. Remember how like, that last part of wondering like which was smart, what's what uh, which one is the story mission, which was not story mission? Yeah, th these two both are story missions. They branch out. Whichever one you go with depends on like you know who you sub with for the ending. So, I want to mean. But the, I kind of, I don't really want to side with the Brotherhood of Steel because they're the really ones who've been, um, I've been trusting the most. They seem like they could be the ones that can, um, you know, really bring this whole place together. I mean, look at, look, look at all the equipment they have, okay? The Institute's really, the Institute's really sketchy and I don't really like the whole hidden order thing, so I'm gonna do the Brotherhood missions. So, I bet you're eager to get your hands dirty on our new project. Yeah, what about it? How much has Maxon told you about it? Um, Proctors. Why all the secrecy? We're pouring every resource we have into this thing. We can't risk tipping off the Institute. For now, the fewer people that know about it, the better. Come on, it's this way. Okay. As you're blind as a bat, I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a gantry on the tarmac. Hey, what? Maxon and Kells have been looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Institute. Now, the Pridwin might be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. What the fuck? That's where our new project comes in. What's your legs? What? 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 You get any legs cut off? Oh, sorry! Hey! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh. Uh, okay. I should have done that. I heard there was like a trophy for pickpocketing. I, I want to see if I can get it, but now. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. Let's do this again. Rewind. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I just died like that. I was like, yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's try this one more time. So. I bet you're eager to get your hands dirty on. Uh -huh. Why secrecy? All the secrecy? Yeah, we've already right. been through this. Come on. Alright, we've been through this. Bat, I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a gantry in the tarmac. Max and and notice. We're looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe to toe with the institute. Oh, and now, the by the way, a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. That's where our new project comes in. Oh, and by the way, the term blind and the bat really isn't relevant because bats have sonar, okay? So I'm not really blind. So. I know my science. From Fall 3, I think. advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had at its disposal. Fortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. I've spent the better part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy, try rebuilding a Protectron while you're blindfolded. Whoa! It was a giant ass robot from Fallout. Fallout. I think it was Fallout 3 or New Vegas. No problem. I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. Huh. I wish I had your confidence. Because this is not going to be easy. Okay. Now, the good news is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. Oh, what do you need? The first problem is his CPU. It's fragile, and every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Hmm. It has to be a way. Hmm. There's got to be a way to solve that. I do all the maintenance on the Pridwin, so you'd think it'd be a snap. As much as I hate to admit it, Prime's power systems are out of my league. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little over a decade ago. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. Alright, cool. Okay, so I gotta convince her. I have an axe, so... Uh, hey, Dr. Ling, fix the giant transformer robot or I'll slice you in the face with an axe. How about that for persuading, huh? Now the Dr. Lee's arrived, I'm certain she'll be quite a brotherhood success. So where is... Oh, no. Don't tell me it's in the airship. Don't tell me she's on the airship. She's on the airship! <laughs> she's on the airship. <laughs> like, don't tell me she's on the airship. Yeah, she's on the airship. Damn it! 
Why can't you be on the ground, Dr. Lee? Why? Okay, the, the, the thing. Uh, here's a little thing I go. Hey, Dr. Lee, uh, why don't you go help build a transformer? Uh, no. How about I start an axe in your brain? Huh? What's about that? Wait, what? Wait, what? Why are there two objectives? Oh, wait, hold on. Let me just... Shush, let me just get rid of those two. And now let me go talk to Dr. Lee with my giant axe. Now I'm not going to shift in the brain unless she comes help with the transformer thing. So, Dr. Lee... Come help with the transformer thing, or I'm gonna shove an axe in your brain. Dr. Lee? Oh, Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee! Dr. Lee? I have an axe, so you do what I say, or I'll shove an axe in your brain. Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee? Attention, all personnel. Dr. Lee! I'm disappointed Dr. Lee. I need to address this, but yes, I'm sanctioned social contact with Commonwealth Dr. Lee. is strictly prohibited. Is she? Is she? Anyone Dr. who is engaged in such fraternization Dr. should report to Night Captain Kate for immediate if decontamination. If you're into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget That is all. <laughs> you promised you'd help us. You're right, I did. But you neglected to mention that I'd be asked to work on Liberty Prime. I've help. been down this road with the Brotherhood before. Why would I make the same mistake twice? Save the Commonwealth. Because we care what happens to the Commonwealth. The Brotherhood may be our only chance of stopping the Institute. You know, if anyone else wearing a Brotherhood of Steel uniform said something like that, I'd laugh in their face. Oh. But coming from you, it sounds like you actually mean it. Tell Proctor Ingram to get her scribes ready. Yeah. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back online. But we'll get it done. Oh yeah. I didn't ask you to ask. Oh yeah! Okay, fuck now. You gotta go back? Really? I am not doing this back and forth. But I'm not doing this back and forth thing. Hold up. Before I do that, I realize I have like a whole bunch of shit in my junk. So I'm gonna... S look up, look up, wait. Look all this junk I have. I'm gonna store all junk. Look, I have 366. Um, wait. Let's see if I can store all junk. Wow! Throw all the junk. It's oh wow. See, that's a good thing. See those like workbench and all that. You can store stuff in them. So if you're a little bit over encumbered and you don't want to get real stuff, just store it in there. Just store it in there. It's all, it's all good. It's all you good. No ah! I like how I'm just swinging an axe around and nobody's like, "What the fuck? <laughs> the fuck is this dude doing?" Oh, I forget. Yeah, hey, dude, I got some doctors Never for you. expected Doctor Lee would return to the Brotherhood. But you're not here to discuss history, are you? Um, are the documents you wanted to turn in? Yeah. Uh -huh. I found some technical documents. These aren't technical. Oh, sorry! I time for game. Oh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Oh, I'm gonna fuck your chair. Fuck your boxes. Fuck your lamp. And fuck your company. Your computer. Let's go. Come on, Codsworth. Alright then, now we gotta go talk to the little chick to get Optimus Prime, Optimus Prime back online. Autobots, roll out! Oh, please tell me he says something similar to that. Like Brotherhood of Steel, roll out! I'll be like, yes. It's, it's, a, it's a stretch, it's a stretch, but... Oh, the fuck, radiation storm! Okay, we're not having none of that, we're gonna go to the bottom. Damn, radiation storm. Damn it. We have to go back and forth now. Why? Do 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 Damn it! Close the door! Close it! Ah! Not a mid closer with me inside of it! Like that. Hey, Doctor! D oh, I have to go back outside, don't I? Oh, the radiation! Oh, the radiation! Oh, the radiation! Oh, the reds! It hurts! 
Alright. Excuse Ingram. me, Proctor Ingram. Wow, things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory core. I wish your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible and there should be a falling into his city. If your people stay out of my way, that is. Oh. Charming, isn't she? Yeah, you can say that again. Sorry about yeah. that. Yeah. Sorry about that, Ingram. Don't worry about it. We might be butting heads on a few issues, but I've dealt with worse. Besides, Dr. Lee's worth all the aggravation. Really? We're working with one of Prime's original designers. I don't see it getting any better than that. In fact, since things are going so well, we're gonna have you start building his electromagnetic actuators. His what? <laughs> sure. Anything you need. That's what I love what? about you. You're ready to leap into action, and I bet you don't have the faintest idea what I'm talking about. The actuators are what allows Liberty Prime's arms and legs to move. Prime's new limbs are way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. We're gonna have to rip those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets, and install them in his limbs. What we need you to do is build the actuators for us. Now that you know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials list. Don't lose them. Now before you get that look on your face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. Really? The only thing we need you to head out and find is a high-powered magnet. How do we do that? According to Proctor Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already sent out a few teams to find the rest of the high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time you return. Once you start building the actuators, we need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Locate a high-powered magnet. Yeah, because, you know, when you go to a hospital, you automatically find a high-powered magnet. You know, when you go to a hospital, you automatically see a high-powered magnet. That's exactly how, you know, you expect to be in a hospital. It's a high-powered magnet. How, why? Why? Just, why? Why? <laughs> Just... Just... I want that. I want to where I can find the Ripper. I want to find that. Okay then. Hospital ho! Wait, did I clear? I think I cleared it right out. Yeah, I think I cleared it, so there should be no enemies. There should be. There should be! But we're still here. Okay, so the high power magnet should be. You heard that, right? I read up, I was talking, I heard I heard something. There's someone here! I heard someone there. Really? Don't make me have to ask you, dude. I just want the high power magnet and then I'll go, okay? I want no trouble. Powerful. Hmm. High power magnet. Thank you. Quick power comments. No, thank you. For stupid noises. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna. I hear something. Just gonna go. Okay. Hear that? It's creepy. Let go. Just gonna go before shit happens. See? 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 We're fine. We're fine. Good. Refine. We're refined. <laughs> and now loading screens. Okay then. Your loading screens. Ah, oh, again, the long ass loading screens. <sighs> Oh, 
Alright then. Okay, I found your high powered magnet thing, Majig. Yeah. Found it. Whoa! What the fuck is that? What gun is that? I want it! I want, where, I want where, where gun that is. I want it. I want it. <laughs> please tell us, like, please tell me get that look later on. Because I don't know what gun it is, but it looks like it hurts. It looks like it hurts a lot. Well. Well. Just. Well. This gun looks like it caused some serious pain. This gun will make you cry. This gun will make you cry. <laughs> okay. Okay. So where is this? Oh, we got there's it. no time to waste when there's work to be done. Yeah, I got it. I got it. No time to waste. Blah, 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 blah. What to be done. Blah, 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 blah. Wait, so we gotta rebuild it over here again? Oh, shit. Wait, the thing... What the fuck? What the fuck happened to this? Is it broken? The thing broken? How the fuck did the thing break? Was it a one-time use thing? <laughs> oh, damn! The special. Uh, Haju. Okay, so one, two, three, four. Okay, built off four. There, one, two, three, four. Activate. <laughs> All lined up, ready to go. Proctor. Proctor. Uh, Proctor. Hello, Proctor. Proctor, I got your hydro whatever blah 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 things ready to go. The human looking sense are the worst. Proctor, that's all four actuators. Delivered and done. All right. Nice work. Thank you. Right on schedule. I've completed the restoration of Prime's basic functions and he's ready to go. In fact, it's getting difficult to explain to the system why it can't move right now. Well, as soon as my scribes get those actuators in place, We'll have his arms and legs installed in no time. Nice. Which brings me to your next assignment. That is? It won't be long before Prime can walk and talk, but he's missing one last important element. His nukes. What? Without them, his offensive systems aren't operating at peak capacity. Uh, oh. Shouldn't be a problem. Just tell Shut. me where they are. I wish I could. Prime's bomb pack is fitted for Mark 28 nuclear bombs. The same type of bombs that were dropped from aircraft during the Great War. The Commonwealth was a major staging area for the military's air force, so we assumed we wouldn't have trouble finding them. Yeah. But since we arrived, our scouting teams haven't located a single bomb. That's going to be a problem. Without a fully loaded nuke pack, Prime won't have the firepower to take on the Institute. Damn. I agree. She's right. Of course she's right. <laughs> yeah, of course she's right. Hope, there's actually a silver lining here. Oh. Proctor Quinlan has located some records regarding a military installation, which was used as a nuclear weapons storage facility. We're fairly certain this included a stockpile of the Mark 28s. The catch is that the installation is located somewhere within the glowing sea. <sighs> I'll head out there immediately. Good, because that's exactly what we're asking you to do. <laughs> yeah, good. That's what you're doing. Established a communications point on the frontier of the glowing sea. I suggest you head out there first and establish a signal protocol with her so that the nukes can be airlifted out once you've located them. Hopefully, by the time you've returned, we'll be ready to wake Prime up and you can say hello. Good luck, Knight. Cool. <laughs> Rearming Prime with nukes should get Prime Halen. Oh, I like things. I like I like this robot already. Oh fuck! <laughs> it's all the way over there. Fuck! All right, I got fast travel to it. Yes, I'm like fuck <laughs> on the walking. Look at this now. Tesla? Tomorrow technology. Today's uh super soldier. I thought it said future soldier. I'm like, 
Damn it, radiation storms! Give away radiation storm! <laughs> the radiation all oh, hurts! Sweet oh jeez! Sweet Jessica Jones! Oh the radiation it hurts! It stinks! <laughs> Please help me! Help me. The last person Help me. Captain it's good to see you again, Knight. You've come a long way since you stumbled in the Cambridge Police From Station. Yeah. So, Thanks, Halen. What's our mission? I assume the place is still in one piece. We're doing the best that we can. We've had the occasional synth attack, but so far we've been able to keep them from overrunning us. Thanks to the reinforcements and the air support, I'd say that site was secure. Cool. That's, That's not hands. surprising. After all, it's in good hands. I right. appreciate that. Anyway, I know you don't have time for small talk, so I'll get right to it. Okay. I've had the men set up the equipment we'll need to pinpoint you once you've found the bombs. We've rigged up this distress pulsar to emit a unique tone that we'll be listening for. When you find the bombs, plant the pulsar, and we'll handle the rest. Cool. After that, you should probably head back to Proctor Ingram and bring her your report. Roger. Distress pulsar. Nice. Doesn't sound too difficult. Ah, oh, no. Not at all. You're only heading back into the most inhospitable place in the entire Commonwealth. Look, I know you've been through the Glowing Sea before, but remember to keep an eye on your Geiger counter. If you don't, the radiation will cook you from the inside out. Oh. Good luck, Knight. That's... Whoa! Okay, so I'm gonna do some power armor to get through there. So when we come back, we're gonna get ourselves some power armor. And then she'll be going there and not die. <laughs> so we're gonna find the nukes, get a power. Alright, so here's the plan. Next video, get a power armor, go over here, find the nukes, put the stress signal, and get Octopus Prime up and running. That is our goal. So, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, everybody, wait, stay awesome, everyone. Alright, Located the biohazard.